Well, Gary, I think Gary used to go to bed like a half a set every evening and he'd be going to bed with his bowl of cereal and we'd be, we'd be criticising him. But he was a really top professional player and his family from a good background. Phil was a brilliant fella. And when lads come into the group and he obviously proper loved the club, and that came true. We, we all embraced Gary. Gary was a decent, a different. Obviously, you t need different characters in your dressing room, but Gary fell into the group, no problem. And we all liked him. We all had a bit of time for him. Obviously, that's changed over was the years. Was he the same character in the dressing room that he is now? <laughs> well, in, in fairness, again, Gary was. When you first get the first team, you're going to be quiet. But Gary became more vocal as he, as he got a bit older and a bit braver. Um, and there's no stopping him now. <laughs> but Gary was a, an excellent player, a really good pro, really looked after himself and went on to win, obviously done very well obviously with United and of course with England. You know, you, you have to have quality to do what Gary did. Do you have a Gary Neville scarf? <laughs> no, <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs>